When a man is interested in marrying a woman, he sends his mother, his sister, his aunt to go and only meet the mother of the girl and the girl and her si sisters only. Totally segregated meeting. They come back to the man and say to him, Wallah, we saw this and that. Her, her hair is this long, it's this soft, it's this black, and she's a little bit fair, she's a little bit uh, uh, dark, she's this, she's that. And they give him a description. He likes what he hears, then he goes and proposes to the man, to the, to the father. He sets an appointment, the father checks on him, looks at him, speaks with him. If the father is happy with that, he asks his daughter, are you okay with the specs of this person? She says, yeah, she's, she's shy, she doesn't comment. So he tells her, okay, I'm going to invite him tomorrow between Maghrib and Isha. And he invites him in. And then he invites his daughter to come and sit. Only the three of them. Nothing big. The father, the girl, and the boy interested. And he sits in between so that when he speaks to the boy, the girl can take a good look at who is interested in marrying her. And when he speaks to the girl, the boy has the ability to check her out. And after an hour, maybe an hour and a half, a little bit less, a little bit more, after they exchange questions and they feel that there is chemistry, the interview is over. The boy goes to his mom and tells her, I like what I see and I'm interested in her. The mother calls her mother and says that my, my son is uh, um, uh, a fan of your daughter. He's yani, loving her and she likes her. And the mother says, Wallahi, my daughter also likes your uh, son, alhamdulillah. Then the men speak together. They appoint a, a time of engagement, of making the marriage contract, etc. And a happy story ends here. Not with the marriage, but I mean, this marriage takes place and it is, inshallah, a happy story. So this is what usually takes place. This is an Islamic way of doing it. 